A band teacher arrested, accused of having sex with a student at an all-girls school. CBS 46's Brittany Eddy is tracking this story for us. She's live outside Coretta Scott King Academy. And Brittany, tell us what you've learned. Well, parents here at the school say this is a place where girls should feel safe coming to learn. And after this news of the arrest of this teacher started sending shockwaves through the academy. Some students say Jovan Burton was known to be a beloved band director. People looked up to him and stuff and they thought, thought of him as a dad. Now he's charged with having sex with a student at Coretta Scott King Academy. This is just shocking to everyone because it's never happened. I was very upset. I feel like uh, our girls should be protected. This is an all girls school and uh, really a misappropriation of power. The school called parents, sent home letters and held a meeting with the entire student body. Telling CBS 46 in a statement in part, quote, Atlanta Public Schools take seriously any instances of employee misconduct, and we will remain vigilant in our efforts to make sure all of our campuses are safe and secure for our students, staff, and visitors, end quote. Students at the school, like Shelby, say they want the girl involved with Burton to know she has support from her classmates. When she come back, because I know she's probably scared, and we, if we was in her shoes, we are probably scared to come to school because we are probably, like, hear rumors about ourselves and I know she probably be scared but if she do come here we're here to like protect her and to comfort her. I heard from parents and students here that one thing some families are concerned about are their band scholarships because Burton was known to not only help but also advocate for students and helping them get some of those scholarships. So now that he's gone, they're wondering what will happen with their kids future. Sharon. So Burton was arrested. Brittany, do we know what's happened since that arrest? Well, we know right now uh, he has been denied bond and his next court appearance is going to be later on in March, about two weeks from now. But another thing is he has resigned from his position here at school.